everybody, Grace Still Plays, and we're back with more Happy Room. No time for BS. Look, we're on number one. This means I haven't gotten my daily dose of torture out of the way. I like how his eyes kind of shifted over to the cursor just a moment ago as if to say, Gray, you son of a bitch. I remember what you did yesterday. Well, guess what, buddy? There's a whole bunch of more pain coming your way. So I hope you've got your freaking helmet strapped on nice and tight. Let's see if we can get a couple more of these various challenges done, as well as I really want to unlock another fatality. Like I said, maybe one of like the lower tiered fatalities. I don't know. We'll see what we can do here. We've got a couple of different things. Keep the dummy for 15 seconds in an ice and freeze ray and activate eight black holes in two seconds. We also have quite a few euros. I've got euros and I know how to use them. Or, well, I don't know. I don't really know what I want to use these on. What is grenade? thrower do more damage more damage here firearms we got here damage uh more gravity guns on the ceiling in there have ya the mace 100 more ammo oh i don't really use the maces that much i feel like i should use those more more teslas more mini lasers cooler black holes more piranhas whoop de do more teleport okay so I think what we're going to do to start things off is try and do this eight black holes in two seconds. That seems like it would be pretty easy, right? Let's go over here and just remove our, our center area and kind of fix it all up with some black holes. Okay, I'm not going to lie. The black holes are ridiculously expensive. We have to activate eight of them in two seconds. I don't actually know how I'm going to do that. Um, I could create some sort of teleportation thing. Hold on. Let me just try this real quick. Okay, so that's four. Very, very quickly, but that is nowhere near enough. Essentially, what we need to do is we need to get him flying through these black holes over to these black holes. The issue is the cost, because holy crap, the black holes cost a shit ton of money. Well, let's try and do something else. Maybe something a little bit less costly. Damn it, we get pretty darn close, though. I'll tell you what. All across the world, the call has gone out for more freaking ice guns. Can you feel it? I can. Freeze him! Yes! Oh my god. <laughs> Was that a 13,000 damage? Oh yeah, here we go. Cryogenically frozen. Yes, frozenality. Say hello to Walt Disney, you rat bastard. Okay, so we got that out of the way. That was pretty easy. I imagine the flamey one. We should be able to get that one done next fairly simplistic. I was thinking about these challenges, but then I decided to just do some more of the fatalities because they're freaking amazing. I do like these zero G things. I'm actually going to like hard click these while I talk because uh, I don't want to have to put those back there. Although after removing like 30 of these now, I feel like I could have just removed everything and put the zero G things back much faster. Anyway, the setup seems to work pretty damn good for most things. I wonder, we have five of the Euros. Can we put some of the things on the walls? The fire gun, we can't, can we? Hold on, what does this do? Uh, okay, <laughs> ceilings and walls, no. Man, I want to be able to put them on the walls, floor, and ceiling. But this one was the best, man. This one allowed us to put it on the middle. You can't do that anywhere else. It pisses me off. Hold on, let's try some, let me try some other things real quick. I wonder if we can get this fire and ice thing done real quick. This is the most efficient way to do it, but it looks freaking cool. It's a lot of firepower we've got there. Get it? Firepower. Oh, yeah. Oh, the me he's on fire and that was pretty cool. Not only was he on fire, he was also frozen, I think. It looked like he was a burning corpse that was freezing at the exact same time. I don't think that that's going to be anywhere close enough for a fatality, though. That's the only issue. It is kind of funny to watch a burning corpse just kind of flip-flop around. So we managed to get burn a dummy down in the water or freeze him. We just, we're missing one side of this. Let's, let's try this one more time. Let me ask you something. You boys like ping pong? Let's freaking do this. Oh yeah. That's what I'm, oh God. The damage, the damage is definitely there. I'm just, I don't think he's staying in one spot long enough to get the, uh, the little freezes and burnings done that we're gonna need. I wonder if we could add, ooh, we just about got it right there. I'm not sure, I'm not sure which hit which. Wow, we're getting pretty close to a fatality as well. Those piranhas are freaking hungry, man. Okay, hold on, I have an idea. Let's take all the fire off of here, and instead of putting fire over there, what do I wanna do? I need to put something, oh, I know what we can do. Hold on, we haven't done this. We can put our, uh, our block out. 
There we go. Blocks out for Harambe. Right there, baby. Let's go ahead and put that out. Put a couple of fire guns on it. All right. Maybe I should move it down a little bit. Right about there, I think, should do it. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Fire guns on there. That just get that gets us just enough fire guns. Man, if I could shove these over, I could probably even put one more in there. I'm not going to worry about it right now. Okay, let's do this. All right, let's see how this gets him going. I don't, I don't know if he's getting cold enough. He's definitely getting burned. Okay, so the burning part, we're not having any issues with the... Oh my god, his body is caught on the block. How could something like this happen? Let me give it one more shot. We're not having problems with the burning... Ooh, we got something right off the bat. I don't even know what that was. I don't know if that was the burn or the, or the frozenness. I have a feeling that was probably the burn. Okay, so the frozen part's what we're lacking. Let me see if I can set up even more of the of the freeze ray guns here and try and finish this off. Burn, then freeze. Burn, then freeze. So maybe the, maybe the deal is he has to burn first. Um, in that case, I have an idea. I think that that little springy thing was facing to the... Uh, hold on, I wonder... Hold on. We should be able to get these... I think I, I don't have these squeezed in like as, as far as they could possibly go. So the issue is, I think we get one more down here. You want to be as efficient as possible with your little jumpy guys. Let's go ahead and put this one over here. And then we're going to put one more going this way. Because we want him to start this way. There. Oh, hold on. Right there. There we go. Okay. Now we should be able to squeeze one more in. Let me tell you something. When it comes to Happy Room, it's all about how much you could squeeze in. Don't let anyone tell you any differently. They're lying. Okay, right there. That should do it. Let's go ahead and start things off. There. It starts him over there. Okay, good. He's burned. And now... Come on, come on, come on, come on. Freeze. Freeze, you bastard. Freeze. Get froze in already, for the love of Jesus. Man, alive. Okay, maybe I'm underestimating the amount of freeze rays I'm going to need. I don't think that, like, that, like, freezing him and then burning... I don't think that burning him takes away the frost. At least I'm pretty sure it doesn't. Okay, I've got, like, maximum freeze rays over here. Now, this should freaking do it. At least I'm pretty sure it will. Okay. Oh, man. We didn't get the burning. There we go. Okay, burning's off the chart. We got it. Come on, baby. Just freeze for Christ's sakes. Get in there and freeze. I can't believe I'm saying this, but for the love of God, freeze the torso. Forget. Whoa, damn it. We got a fatality again. It was the frozenality. Ooh, if we have the level of damage it takes to get fatalities, I wonder if we can get it with the Bernie one. Hold on, let's give it a shot here. One more time, real fast. Ready, set, go, damn it. There's a ton of, we, we're getting like max damage though that you could possibly get in one chunk. I think we, there's 10,000 damage before anything stopped. Come on, man, all the flamey things are done. He should be pretty, yeah, oh, god damn. There it is again. All right, so frozenalities for days. Let me let me mix things up a little bit here. You'd figure with some tank manipulation, oh, <laughs> springality. I just I manipulated the areas of the tanks. I put them. I put this one over here so that it's kind of like shoved in the middle of more of the flame guns. I thought maybe that uh, that that would help out a little bit. All right, we got it. Holy shit, we got the freezy part and then the fire part. Now, you know, man, I really want to, I think he's, oh, we got it, virality, that's pretty cool, negative a thousand degrees and plus a thousand degrees in the same episode, look at the flaming spear of pain and suffering, this is a really good setup, hold on, I think we can unlock a whole bunch of different things with this setup, in fact, we may try and unlock a couple more fatalities, hold on here, like, if we replace these orbs, or not the orbs, if we replace those, uh, the piranhas with something else, I don't know, maybe like our, uh, like our axes or something, we could also use the maces to see if we can finish him off with maces. I don't think we've done that. We can even use saws if we wanted to. Uh, we barely have enough for the axe. So I think what I'm gonna do is I am gonna use it, but I'm gonna turn it this way so it kind of throws him back into the into the uh, ice. Let's try this real fast just to kind of see what it does, damage wise. That is. Now we also need to unlock the rest of the. Uh, oh, here we go. We're gonna see some level of uh, of fatality. I just don't know if it'll be the. Uh, no, it's not gonna be the axe. It's gonna be like another burnyality there. Oh my god, another springality. I can't even tell anymore. There's so much fire and springiness and blood and ass and chunks shooting everywhere you never even know at this point 
I can unlock the last thing for the uh, the springs, though. Hold on. The jumpers right here. This way we can place them on the walls and the ceiling. You can do that right there. In fact, let's see here. We could probably put a couple of these down right now and try and unlock this. Let's uh, let's see here. We'll do... Um, now, if you put it on the ceiling, which way does it go? That's my question. Hold on. So if we select it, like, is it going to... Which way does this actually going to jump? Ah, whatever. We'll just put a bunch down here and pray for the best. I'm sure things will work out just fine. I mean, there we go. Couple like this over here. And then, uh, ah, what the hell? We'll go ahead and put some of just the straight shooter ones over here. How many can we get on this wall? Or about four. Oh, can I shove? Hold on. No, all right. I was wondering if I could shove the other one up and be able to, like, get one more in there. It doesn't look like I can. All right. Let's go ahead and see if we can get this done. So, there's the floor, there's the, I don't know what that was, the ceiling, oh, Jesus Christ. Hold on, did, did, we must have gotten it by now, right? I'm pretty sure we got them all. Hit a dummy with a jumper on the floor, ceiling, and walls. Yeah, we definitely got it. How come it's not giving it to us? This is kind of odd. Oh, God, all right, that was just another frozenality. I don't even know what happened there. We had so many, the, the poor bastard was bouncing all over the place so much, I couldn't even tell. I know what was wrong. It's walls, not just one wall. So we need both walls to spring them off of. So this should pretty much do it. I got some mini guns in here too, just for the hell of it. There we go. That worked out pretty good. I wonder if we can get a fatality with the mini guns. Should be plenty of bullets to do a bunch of ass whippery. Keeping them, keeping them pretty good over there too. Only question is, with less of the ice rays in here, I'm not sure. Okay, so it doesn't do enough damage. Does our mini guns? Do I have those all the way upgraded? I kind of wonder. Oh, we can get acid too. Mmm. Acid. Well, considering, now that we don't need these anymore because we just completed that, we can go ahead back over here to our miniguns and we can put a bunch of more of these on the walls. I kind of like my axes there. It makes me feel good. So, let me take these off here because we don't need those either. They're just not doing enough damage. They do some damage, just not like a ton of damage. Let's try, let's try this real quick. Um, if I have to, I could probably get rid- we could get rid of these freaking blades. Although, man, I want to do a bladed fatality. I want it so much. I want to know what happens when we get it. Ow, oh, he stopped moving! Mom, the dead torso stopped moving! Rat-a-tat-tat! Taste my gut! Motherfucker! Yes! Bulletality! Oh, I knew it was possible for us to accomplish. I told you, man. This setup, I'm really liking it. Okay, bulletality. Nice. I'm not really sure what else we could do here. I'm not sure what does a lot of... Oh, you know what? We haven't really messed around with the acid gun. The only problem with the acid gun is, is that I don't really think... I kind of wonder. Hold on. Let's go over here. We have three of the euros left. We'll go ahead and unlock this last portion of the acid gun. I don't know if it will do enough damage to do as I please. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and outfit the walls with acid, though. I can't see anything going wrong with this in any way. Another thing that's really going to be a pain in my ass is the axe one. Because the axes are so damn much. So I have to find something that doesn't cost that much, but does a lot of damage. I haven't really done enough testing with all these things to see what gives you the best bang for your buck. Isn't that sad? Instead of trying to min-max the game, I've just been, you know, playing normally. Just, just blowing people up as needed. Oh, we can fit a couple of extra thingies right over here. There we go. And we even have enough. What else do I want to do here? Oh, we can put our little, uh, we can put our, our block down if we wanted to. Again, though, I don't know if this is going to be enough damage. Let me think about this for a second. We could also put an axe down. Or we could put down just more of the ice guns because we know the ice guns are good for big damage. Uh, in fact, we can get we can get several more of these down. Hold on, is there any other place I can shove more ice guns? I guess I could just put more over here. There we go. All right, hold on. Let's go ahead and activate this real quick and kind of see what happens. All right, acid's doing okay. Acid seems to stick around for quite a while. Not too shabby. Ooh, it does stick to the walls. That's pretty sweet. Okay, yeah, I think we're gonna get it. Hold on, hold on, hold on here. Okay, baby, keep getting acidified. Keep getting acidified. Come on, come on. Burn a little bit longer. Yes. Yes, he's getting acid all over the place. Oh, 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 yes. We got it. Lift him up. Lift that piece of, lift that chunk of 
freaking roast beef up and throw it inside of the poison vat. Oh, happy room. Are you done corrupting the morals of the internet yet? The answer is no. Let's go ahead and do one more of these uh, challenges real quick. It just said explode 100 mines in one test. It's a lot of mines. I think we should be able to do it though. Let me get rid of the center here. Oh yeah, 8,000 8, bucks. Holy crap. All right, guys, hold on a second while I, uh, wh I wish there was a mine button. So this is, this is basically seeing how much OCD you can possibly have right here. Can you sit there and click 100 mines? And the answer is yes. So, um, instead of, <laughs> instead of just sitting here with you guys while I do this, I'll be right back. Actually, it went a lot faster than I thought it would. Went ahead and put a bunch of them over on the wall, on the wall over here. I think we'll be fine. Um, let me go ahead real quick though and make sure that this little one cants him over to this side. There we go. That should work pretty good. At least I'm pretty sure it will. All right, let's go ahead and do this. We should have, oh my God. It, it, it like caused my computer to pause for a second. There we go. 100 mines. We got it. Now, I don't think that this is going to do enough damage to get any kind of fatality, but that's fine. I just wanted to unlock that real fast. Plus, I think that got us another euro. I'm pretty damn sure. Okay, let's just stop this real quick. Teleport a cube twice. Teleport a cube twice? Cube? I didn't know you could teleport cubes. Well, I guess we could do that. Yep, we're back up to three euros. All right. So we got a bunch more fatalities and a bunch more of the little challenges done. That's pretty cool. There's still more fatalities, damn it. Still plenty of fatalities. I think we've only unlocked not even half of them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not even half of them. We haven't done any of the uh, of the melee ones yet. We've done a few of the weaponry. Oh, it's probably not even a third now that I think about it. Oh, yeah, we still have plenty of these to do. And I imagine there's one for the mine as well. Um, even though we would need more base damage to get that going. Guys, hope you enjoyed Happy Room. I know number 34 won't. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.